we were reflecting last night after market closed. Both Denise and I are so thankful, we are so grateful for the success that we experienced during this market. Um, we showed major, major tremendous increases over last summer and possibly last winter market. When we started putting the showroom together, we had major moves. We had several new lines coming in. We were facing a very difficult setup. And I think we both went into it not really anticipating the successful outcome that we had. Don't you think? Oh, absolutely. And we had several new vendors that came in with us this time at very, very short notice, and they were amazing. Sarid came in and brought in the product within a week, and we managed to put their showroom together in a very short period of time. Great thing about all the new vendors that we had, most of them had never been seen in Las Vegas. And everyone that came by kept saying, I've never even heard of some of these companies, when Sarid is one of those companies that it launched this time. Rachel Ashwell, another great line that launched. Uh, Gallery Designs, also very exciting line. Celadon Art. What was amazing was to really hear the thanks and the gratitude from our new vendors that came in and our old vendors. They really appreciate what both of us have done creating this, this destination here on C5. Um, we put a lot of effort into marketing. We put a lot of effort into merchandising. I, what I found exciting was that I saw more new buyers that haven't yeah. been to our showroom that stayed in here and bought pretty much every line. So when we go back into the territory and we go into our retail stores, we'll see nothing but MDBG. Yeah, so was, that's exciting. Yeah, it was really exciting. It was really exciting to see so many new stores that had never been to Vegas before, which was also something that we saw. And the traffic was really, was, was pretty good, I would say. Buyers that were here did buy, they were excited. We also had a great, great turnout for the circus on, on Sunday night. That was amazing. But you know, actually, I really felt that traffic was pretty steady. It was steady. I mean, yeah, we, I had, it was we steady. had some slow moments, but the first thing I really noticed after, say, the second or third day was that there were more buyers in here than last summer. Yeah, absolutely. I knew, I knew we were going to have an increase. Yeah. And the people that we worked with were purchasing. Yeah, absolutely. And there, I think that the attitude seemed better and that I think the attitude overall for the vendors are positive. They're looking forward to the end of the fourth quarter and that things are looking up and I think you know we're gonna end up with a good year after all. Exactly. We're looking forward to several new lines that want to come in for winter market and we've already got our concept. We still have our angels up above us. Yeah. I think that's what really I think they're on our shoulders I actually. Think so too. So, I mean, we're both feeling very blessed right now. I could start crying. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. I think, you know, the feeling in our showroom is that we're a family. We're, every vendor in here is very, I, very dear to our heart. I love that. And we're going to continue to build that. And we build that with our, with our stores that they should feel comfortable in here. And that's, this is their second home. They come at night. They don't have to purchase from us. Come see us. Just come play with us. Come see the lines. Come drink and party and come and see our big disco ball. Exactly. And our cow, our sweet cow. We gotta name the cow. I know we have to name the cow. And Timey, our our mm -hmm. mascot, which you'll see more of Timey too. I loved what Pendalux did to their showroom. Absolutely. That was pretty amazing. Yeah. And it really affected. I mean, it was wall to wall people in there. Pretty much non-stop. They were very, very happy. Absolutely. Very excited about that outcome. Spiker, I mean, what to say about Spiker? Spiker is always awesome. Yeah, and then Mitchell Black, a new uh, line in our showroom, did floor cloths this time, and they were a great hit. We have a lot of very, very good vendors in MDBG, and we're going to keep bringing new vendors to, to the mix, and we hope that you can come join us in January. What do you think? That would be Mora Bora, the Bianchi group, my friends. <laughs> we have to find some consistency with yeah. our marketing. Yeah, that's why I threw the cow in tiny. <laughs> yes.
What do you think? I think that's a wrap. We really thank you. We really appreciate. We really, Absolutely. we're so happy that everybody feels like we're one big family here. Big success. And for all those that are no longer going to be part of our showroom, we wish them also the best. And we will see them throughout the industry. And um, God bless you all. Thank you.